teacher talk and sports, what it does, what it do, how we live in today. Kawhi Leonard is seen as an outstanding player, but one that has a lengthy history of injuries. He's also kind of become the face of the load management era in the NBA. A lot of missed time, a lot of missed time in the postseason, especially after joining the Los Angeles Clippers. But let's not forget what a career he's had. Two championships, one with the Spurs, one with the Raptors, finals MVP. In both of them, back-to-back -back defensive player of the years, seven-time All-NBA, six-time All-Defensive member in his career. Uh, so definitely one of the all-time greats, part of the NBA's 75th anniversary team. Well, well, he's got a bunch of accolades, but one he does not have is the league MVP. Uh, he's never done so. Two finals MVPs. One um, all-star game MVP, but never the NBA MVP. And I've said six-time all-defensive. He's seven-time all-defensive. Well, enter Kendrick Perkins. You might not always agree with his opinion. Uh, here, though, he says that Kawhi Leonard is the greatest player without an MB and without an MVP award. This is via basketball sphere. So, uh, cho he chose Los Angeles Clippers player Kawhi Leonard as the best player in history without an MVP award. Uh, Perkins compared Leonard's performances in the playoffs to those of Jor Michael Jordan, Kawhi Leonard, Michael Jordan, some of the greatest playoff runs in the history of the game. They broke up then, should say they. They broke up Happy Holmes. He then made one of the greatest players of all time tap out. And I'm talking about LeBron James, especially was especially when Kawhi was in San Antonio, Kendrick Perkins said in the latest episode of ESPN's NBA Today. So uh, definitely a take that might have some validity. He's definitely one of the best ever to not win MVP. But is he the best? Let's take a quick look at some of the names that haven't won MVP in the league uh, that are also considered amongst the greats. And, you know, we could start with the logo that is Jerry West, um, you know, take the, <coughs> excuse me, took the Lakers to numerous finals, only won one, uh, but, you know, often ran up against a powerhouse Celtics team. And another Laker great, sorry, uh, Elgin Baylor, uh, Elgin Baylor, uh, never won a ring, but has some of the best numbers in NBA history, like averages, scoring, rebounding. Uh, was an incredible player. But if you want to go more recent, let's say, you know, from 1980s, 1990s on, we got Chris Paul now currently of the San Antonio Spurs, approaching the age of 40, but uh, he's known as the point guard for a reason. Another point guard in John Stockton, who is the all-time leader in both assists and steals. Another point guard, some know him as Zeke Isaiah Thomas. Uh, Thomas was the best player on two Detroit Pistons teams that won back-to-back -back rings. We got uh, one of the greatest shooting guards of all time, Dwayne Wade, um, three-time champion in his career, also won a scoring championship. We got the Hoya Destroya, Patrick Ewing, arguably the best player in New York Knicks history. We have Scotty Pippen, Pippen. Uh, often seen as the Robin to Batman, Michael Jordan, but Pippen was a elite defender, and um, you know the season that Jordan uh, was playing with the White Sox minor league team led them to one of the best records in the league. I believe that was his best MVP finish, and then another elite point guard in Jason Kidd. I believe he's second all time in assists and steals, um, and. Sorry, he did win a championship with the Mavericks late in his career. Those are just some of the names that uh, have also haven't won a ring. Um, and I'm looking at this K. 
Kidd second or is, yeah, so Kidd is second in assists, although Chris Paul should be passing him this season. And then Steals, he is also second. Paul is 70 behind him. So, um, yeah, Paul could be overtaking Kidd for second all-time in assists and steals. But do you agree with Kendrick Perkins that uh, Kawhi Leonard is the best player in NBA history to never win MVP? Would you uh, go with one of the names I included or is there someone else I named? I mean, there's other greats. Gary Payton, Walt Clyde Frazier. I don't know. I keep thinking of point guards. Uh, Bob Lanier. Uh, many others that have never won MVP, but definitely went on to have Hall of Fame careers. Anyhow, don't forget to subscribe. Tell a friend, tell a friend, tell a friend. Subscribe, like the video, share the video, hit the bell for notifications. I'm out.